the top 10 honorable mention rock albums of the 1990s. These are albums that just missed my top 10s for the years from 1990 to 1999. Number 10, ACDC, The Razor's Edge, 1990. Grade, B-. While Brian Johnson sounds tired, and most of the songs on this album are mediocre, it does have one good song with a famous intro. Standout track, Thunderstruck. Number 9, Depeche Mode, Violator, 1990. Grade B minus. This album includes one great song that was later covered very well by both Johnny Cash and Marilyn Manson, making it one of the few songs with a great original version and two great cover versions. Standout track Personal Jesus. Number eight, The Smashing Pumpkins, Melancholy and the Infinite Sadness, 1995. Grade B minus. Billy Corgan's voice annoys me on almost every song but this album includes the one absolutely great Smashing Pumpkins song that is the exception to that rule. Standout track, Bullet with Butterfly Wings. Number 7, George Thorogood and the Destroyers, Boogie People, 1991, Grade B+. Another good album from George Thorogood with one good original song and good covers of songs originally by John Lee Hooker, Muddy Waters, and Howlin' Wolf. Standout tracks, If You Don't Start Drinking, I'm Gonna Leave, Madman Blues, Can't Be Satisfied, No Place to Go. Number 6, Weezer, The Blue Album, 1994, Grade B+. Weezer's debut includes their absolute best song, plus a song that famously had a video inspired by and using clips from Happy Days. Standout tracks, Say It Ain't So, Buddy Holly. Number 5, Oasis, What's the Story, Morning Glory, 1995, Grade B plus. Wonder Roll is overrated and overplayed, but there are two other singles from the second album that are good. Standout tracks, Champagne Supernova, Don't Look Back in Anger. Number 4, Oasis, Definitely Maybe, 1994, Grade B plus. This is a Beatles-inspired band's very good debut album, but I actually wish they sound even more like the Beatles. Standout tracks, Shaker Maker, Supersonic. Number 3, The Offspring, Smash, 1994, Grade B+. Plus. Besides Green Day, The Offspring are the best of the pop-punk bands, and early on they had a bit of a harder edge to their sound. Standout tracks, Come Out and Play, Self-Esteem. Number 2, Green Day, Kerplunk, 1991, Grade B+. Plus. Green Day's second album includes one great song that would also be included on their breakthrough album Dookie, and another good song, and a great bonus track, a cover of The Who's first big hit. Standout tracks, Welcome to Paradise, 2000 Light Years From Home. Standout bonus track, My Generation. Number 1, Green Day, 39 Smooth, 1990. Grade B+. Green Day's independent debut is very good, and includes one of my absolute favorite Green Day songs. Standout tracks, Going to Pasolacqua, Don't Leave Me, 16, the judge's daughter.